Hi friends, welcome to Taste to Explore. My name is Darlene. Now today, my friends, I'm going to be making a very delicious but simple and healthy breakfast recipe. But before we get into that, I seriously want to wish all my viewers, my subscribers, and all my friends out there a happy and blessed New Year's. Now, how ironically, this new year, 2020, to me, it symbolizes like a, a double portion, a double blessings. So I want to speak onto everyone's behalf, double blessings for this new year, double portion of God's best in your life. Okay, so I wish you all the very best. And I pray that you keep on looking forward, that you keep your faith up. And that you speak only positivity in your life because that is what's going to help you through the years to come. So, once again, happy blessed New Year's. Now, to get started with this recipe. So, we are making a very simple and delicious recipe. Perfect for the New Year. I know everybody wants to start off the New Year right, um, eating healthy and trying to lose all the excess fat that, you know, we gain throughout You will only time. need but a few ingredients to get this started. So now let's begin on this awesome recipe. Alright friends, now let's begin. Right here I have three cups of almond milk. Now I particularly love the one that comes with vanilla and it's lightly sweetened. That's the one I'm choosing to use today. You can use whatever uh, plant-based milk that you like. You can even substitute it for uh, coconut milk or even whole milk. I mean, it's really up to you. And right here I have some chia seeds. Now this is a half a cup of chia seeds. Chia seeds sometimes come in white. You can use the black one like I'm using today or the white one it doesn't really matter now here is how it works because this comes already uh, pre-sweetened from the container and it already has uh, vanilla which is from the container I don't have to worry about uh, jazzing it up because it's already it already comes that way I am going to put my chia seeds right in give it a nice little stir now what chia seeds does is it blooms and becomes really thick inside here I mean it really becomes nice and put in and it's perfect see it is absolutely magnificent um, so what I'm gonna do is you can allow this to bloom in your refrigerator just like this for four hours or you can do this overnight the choice is absolutely yours hi guys welcome back well now I'm going to reveal to you the most delicious and healthy breakfast or snack treat ever and it is done look how amazing this looks <gasps> so rich and creamy Look how rich and creamy it looks but yet it is so healthy it's just simply amazing so now i'm going to serve me up a bowl that i have right here cute little bowl and then i have some fruits the fruits of choice that i picked but of course you don't need to eat over fruits it's just optional i have some cut up strawberries I got some uh, blackberries, blueberries, I got some pineapple, I got some kiwi, and I'm thinking about even putting a banana right in there as well. So, so, so good. So here is how we're going to do this. Alright guys, so here is how we're going to do this. You can eat as much as you like. You can have a half a cup to a full cup. It's totally up to you I have made here three cups so this can last me anywhere from two to three days you can make a nice big batch and just make it for a few days maybe 
four or five days the most i would say i wouldn't go over that and this is a great snack like i said breakfast is fulling because the uh, chia seeds is loaded with vitamins fiber um omega-3s and whatnot i mean you can search on and you will find a delicious um and nutritious array of things that it offers and for no particular uh way i'm just gonna start putting in some strawberries that i had chopped up simple easy but yet so tasty and you just want to eyeball how much you want of your berries and fruits i mean it's totally up to you so so easy guys and as simple as this looks this is actually one of the simplest ways right, my to friends, do this you can eat this just like that or if you want you can top it off with a little bit of honey you don't have to it's totally up to you any sweetener you know is really up to you and how you want to take this i'm just gonna put just a little bit of honey i mean it's really more for the fruits than anything all right friends so now that you know how to make this delicious healthy treat why not give it a try now let me advise you that this my friends is so so good and even though the flavors of choice that i'm i am showing you today is pretty simple just using that almond milk that has the vanilla and lightly sweet and really goes a long way because as you eat healthy you know you want to cut back on certain things but a certain sweetness but this is just like the perfect amount of sweetness is absolutely divine mm. Mm -hmm. so good I'm going to eat some with the fruits in it. Mm. Wow. Mm -mm. I am loving this. Mm -mm. So friends, wow. Completely delicious. The chia seeds is fully um, absorbed or the milk it is divine now here are some suggestions now for this recipe you know I have mentioned that we had used three cups of milk any milk of your choice with a half a cup of chia seeds now I just want to warn you that Different brands of chia seeds produces different results. So certain brands, you might just need only a half a cup and then it just does its job and becomes nice and thick like this. But then there's certain brands of chia seeds that doesn't yield the same results. And you might need to put a tablespoon or two more so you can play around with the ratios and how thick or thinner do you want your chia seed putting to be and it just depends on your preference that day maybe you want something thick and hearty or something a little loose you know it's really up to you really delicious you can really play around with the ratios if you want it thick or thin and remember you're gonna need four hours to refrigerate or preferably overnight so thank you my friends for joining me today you know it's always a pleasure of having each and every one of you cook along with please me please follow me through my social media sites i would love to chat with each and every one of you so enjoy your new year i i pray that you have a blessed and safe and abundant new year may god bless each and every one of you and i will see you again take care bye bye